Nessa Sunshine here, and today we are getting into the ColourPop Sweet Talk palette using using it and we're doing this look so if you want to get this look with a favorite I know this is a favorite of many it's so pretty and peachy and you could do a lot of really pretty peachy looks orangey looks somewhat pink looks a look like this so I hope you enjoy this tutorial and if you do make sure to like it subscribe to my channel if you're not already and let's get into the tutorial shadow I'll be getting into is dream maker and I'll be using the ColourPop e2 brush with the tip of my brush I'm using circular motions and I'm taking it in the outer crease and then moving in the center and then moving forward onto the lid. I'm gonna take more of Dream Maker. What I did is just swirl my brush into the pan. So I did that again. Now I'm using swiper motions with the tip of the brush and I'm blending out toward the tip of my eyebrow. I swirled my brush again into Dream Maker and now I'm going to move above the center of my eye and then I'm gonna move in a little bit toward the inner corner area. And I'm going to lightly blend it up to my eyebrow and lightly blend up above with the tip of the brush above my eyebrow on the outer edge as well. And then I'll do the same thing to the other side. The next shade I'll be getting into is Feel Free and I'll be using the same color Pop E2 brush. In the outer corner, I'm going to start to move in some circular motions with the tip of the brush, just like I did with the other shadow that I just put on. And um, I'm mainly focusing it in the outer corner on the mobile lid and then also in the crease as well. I'm taking more and then blending it in the outer corner. I'm gonna take more the spray. So I'm tapping it in this outer corner a bit and I'm sort of blending in circular motions. I'll take it in the crease now and swiping motions a little bit more and on the mobile corner as well. And in circular motions, I'm gonna to start to blend it up in this outer corner. So I'm very gently blending out the outer corner after moving above in the center of the crease. I'm blending very gently, holding my brush like a pencil toward my face and using the tip and edge to gently blend and softly blend up and out. And I'm blending up. So just diffusing, you could add as much or as little as you want. You can make this look a lot softer and more relaxed, <laughs> or you can make this more intense, more dramatic by continuing to build. If you are having trouble with deeper shadows on your lids, I notice that if I spray deeper colors with uh, like, um, like this, like how I spray my shimmer shadows, I notice that it blends and attaches much better. But just because I have a dry patch here in this on this eye, so unfortunately, what can I do? My eyelid holds a lot better. Um, when I spray my brush, even with a matte shade. So yeah, if you're having trouble in building, go ahead and add Feel Free to the other side, and then we will get into um, shimmer shade. <laughs> the next shadow I'll be using is Side to Side, and that's our Shimmer Shimmer Shade, and I'll be using the ColourPop E19 brush. First, I'll be using my handy dandy ring finger and I will swipe it onto my lid and then I will take the E19 brush and make sure that it's really coated with side to side. I'm sort of pressing the brush into the pan and then I will start to move it um, into the inner corner and then I'll start to move it up above the crease as well, very carefully. And then um, what I'll do is sort of take the shade Feel Free and the E two brush, the blending brush I was using before, and then sort of blending that through so that the shimmer and the matte meet nicely in that outer area. Okie dokie. So at this moment, I'm going to have a makeup miracle moment, and I'm going to apply my face off camera, come back with some lashes, and I'll be wearing the ColourPop lashes in the style Chick, so Chick Falsies. I think that's what they call them, Falsies. Falsies, Falsies for lashes. So I'm gonna put this style on. I think they're now in like a soft pink, like a really pretty light pinky peachy color box. These are pretty lashes. So I'll pop those on and then I will have my face on. We'll finish the lower lash line together. And I'll tell you what lip I'm wearing at the end of this video. And voila, a make a miracle moment has occurred on my face. I'm going to do finish the lower lash line, which will be super simple. What we'll do is mix the two colors, Dream Maker and Feel Free with the uh, ColourPop E7 brush. And I'll go ahead and add it to the outer corner of the eye. 
and then blend it forward. So I'm gonna go ahead and put Catch Me in this inner corner so it's a matte brightening. By the way, the brush I just used for adding Catch Me into the inner corner and blending it out um, and diffusing everything was the E16 brush from the brush bundle. So go ahead and do that to the other side if you're following along and then add mascara. For lips today, I am wearing the liner in Minute Man and the lipstick in Bloom to Bloom. Thank you so much for watching this tutorial using the beautiful Sweet Talk palette from ColourPop. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure to like this video, subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribed already, and I will see you guys next time. I hope you guys are staying safe and staying well. Bye. Bye now.